Hello everyone, this is BCS Buster, and welcome back to Let's Play Breath of Fire 3. Well, last time we uh, eventually made it out of the Daona Mine, and then we also uh, re-entered the fairy world, and now we're going to help them build the civilization. So, basically we're going to tell them what to do, and hopefully we get it right. Um, one thing I forgot to mention is that um, in order for the civilization to advance, to, to get stronger, you basically just need to go through the story and just fight random battles and and basically, as you, as you progress through the game, just keep enter the fairy rings, and you'll be able to progress the uh, the civilization there. So just go through that, and everything will be fine. But for right now, what we want to do is we want to continue on with the story. So let's head down this way and make our way to the Ogre Road. Hmm, maybe it is haunted. Well, let's take a look. Nice somber music there. And we got a new enemy here, the Goo Titan. Basically just another uh, next level of goo there. Like I said, these guys can actually hit some. Kind of sort of hard. So you just want to watch out. Watch out for them. Wow, they got more HP than I thought. Ow! Actually hit pretty hard, too. There we go. Got him. Good amount of experience, though, too. Might not be a bad idea to fight them for the level grinding. And Gar gained a level. Very nice. All right. Let's just move along here. Um, the path is, for the most part, pretty linear. Um, I'm trying to see if I can make it up there and get that chest. Now we got a new enemy here, the Slasher. The next version of... Uh, oh, it is... Gar's intelligence is down. Well, that's not good. Basically, that means his magic stat is lowered. Ow! So this is the next level of Raven, but we were able to take that out without much problems. There. Let me get some berries. Very nice. Okay, let's see if I can make it up there. And let's see if I can get the proper way to get up there so I can get that chest. Hmm. Alright, let's just keep making our way forward. And uh, hopefully we'll find a, a way to... Oh, man, maybe it's up here. All right, so let's head down this way. And, ooh, there we go. Now I can go up here and make my own way over to get that chest. Now we got a new enemy here, the Vagabond. Now you want to take out the Tricker first, because the Tricker I know I can kill with one shot. There we go. But the Vagabond, I can't quite do that yet. There you go, good shot, Gar. Ooh, and Ryu even gets an extra attack, and that's good. There we go, good shot, team. Very nice. You know, I'm wondering if... I just thought of something here. Uh, let's equip on Gar. Uh, let's equip the Midas Stone on him. So this is Jill, he's already pretty low. Might as well do that so we can get some extra gold. That just makes sense. Okay, over this way... There we go. Ooh, and the hourglass. Now, this is an interesting item. Let's see what this does. Ah, stops all but the user for three turns. That can be pretty useful, especially in boss battles uh, later on in the game. So that's pretty nice. Oops, let's get a little bit there. All right, very good. All right, now let's make our way back. See if we can't uh, make our way out of this area. There we go. Just jump off down there. Go down this way. By the way, uh, against those goo titans, double blow is a good uh, thing, a good uh, item, or a good uh, item there. Uh oh, I don't like that. Whoa! 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 the heck is that thing? Well, that doesn't sound too happy to see us. And now it's time for a regular battle against the Weird Tiger. Now, we don't need to worry about changing into a dragon for this one. The only thing that you need to know is that he's really fast. Uh, so you really want to think about uh, your healing there. Sometimes he can even attack you before you heal. Oh, man, good shot, Ryu. That's awesome. 
Um, so you want to think about... Uh, you almost got to heal, like, two turns in advance. Wow. I'm just getting lucky with these critical hits today. It's awesome. Yeah. So you just hit him for a little bit, and eventually he'll run away. Which is, uh... Kind of cowardly, but... What are you gonna do? Alright. I don't think there's anything up here. I'll check just to be sure, but... No, nothing up here. So, let's just go this way and get out of here. And just more of those slasher enemies. No problems there. Alright, now we've made it back here to the world map. Uh, oops. Yeah, so now that we've gone through that area, you can basically just... Uh, you can now make your way uh, through there without having to go through that area again. So, that's pretty nice. And now we're back in the Ural region, where we started the game, so that's pretty cool. Alright, let's see how we're doing in the fairy world here. Yes. Sure. Now let's see how our civilization is doing. Now that we've gone through a little bit of an area there. Hmm, nothing new on the message board. Let's check in with everybody and let's see how everything's doing. Okay, yes, 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 yes. Yes, I know what to do. All right, let's see how we're doing here. Well, we've hunted a little bit, so that's good. And we're still developing jobs, so that's good. Let's see how uh, Palace is doing. Yeah, so everything's the same. Yeah, that looks good, and Ein's good. Okay, very good. So, uh, as you can see, not much has happened there, so we don't need to worry about that. You can pretty much get an idea of what's going on, uh, if anything new has happened, by just reading the message board when you enter the area there. So, just something to think about as you go. Alright, let's keep moving along here. Ah, Mount Levitt. I believe that's our next goal. Let's rest up a little bit first before going through anything. Let's see what Gar has to say. Uh-huh. I have no idea. I don't really know how that all works. All right, let's see. Um, check out our master list and see how we're doing there. Yeah, so we still got a bunch of people that are, that are with us, so that's kind of cool. All right, let's rest up. All right, let's go. Alright, so for right now, all we want to do is just continue to move forward. And basically, we just want to head up Mount Levitt, a steep mountain road that connects the mine and the main road. Cool. Alright. Let's go and head this way. And we got a new enemy here, the Blue Goblin. Kind of an upgrade from, the, uh, from those boss goblins that we fought earlier in the game. Ooh, these are a little bit tougher. Well, I, say, I mean, not really. I guess they're upgrades from the regular goblins that we fought earlier in the game. Fortunately, Ryu's speed is still really high, so we can... There we go. Good job. I don't know if the victory was great, but you can certainly think it was great, and I'm okay with that. All right, now let's head up this way. And now we want to go here. Ah! Dang it. Actually, no, I wanted to do that. Don't worry. And we get a gold hairpin, and we'll use that a little bit later. All right, now let's head out this way and make our way out of here. Very good. Now here, whee! Okay, and now this way. Go up this big road from before. And another level for Gar there. And ooh, his HP and his power and his defense went up. Very good. Again, the stats that I really care about with him. All right, very good. Now let's head this way, and now we want to go down here, whee, and get, ooh, 800 zenny. Every little bit helps, right? All right, now down over here, and in the cave. I really need to work on getting Agar a stronger weapon, because right now his weapon uh, can't kill everybody in one hit, and that's kind of annoying. All right, now here. Okay, now we want to head up this way, after defeating those slasher enemies, 
And now here, and down this way. All right, and I believe if we just follow the path and head down this way, we're out of there, all right. Very good, and now we've made our way back to the world map on this side. Now, unfortunately, to go back to the other side of the world, you have to make your way back through Mount Levitt, which kind of sucks. It's kind of like what you had to do in earlier uh, Breath of Fire, uh, in Breath of Fire 2. And there's a small hut there, we'll check that a little bit later. I believe if we've gone this, we have now made our way west of the Down of Mine, but we've made it back to the Ural Road, and now we're back on this side of the world. But what a, a new adventures await us on this side, and what was the deal with that tiger? You'll have to wait till next time to find out. So then, this is BCS Buster signing off. Don't forget to like me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter at BCS Buster LP, check out my blog, check out my donations page, and as always, take care of y'all.